We're now turning our attention to a little preview of the market report. And Bruce, I understand, you know, markets were up and down, but they ended on a good note. And Grant, so much attention there on that Lego man. You know, she mentioned, Denise, that about it uh, going viral. But then talk about just a little bit logistic-wise, uh, street closures, things like that. We actually have talked to several neighbors who have come up to us wanting to know exactly what happened here. And in fact, we talked to one woman who apparently might have heard the shots and might be a witness in this case. Had a lot of mentions about electability. We've heard about that all throughout the election here, whether Mitt Romney, New Cambridge, or somebody else can beat Obama. The last few days, we've had to really pay attention to the weather forecast because it's very different from one day to the next. And she said at one point, quote, we don't prosecute by public pressure or petition. You may remember all of the protests around the country related to this case and having to do with the stand your ground law. The ex LAPD police officer accused of killing three people, including a Riverside police officer, now said to be pinned down after an exchange of gunfire with law enforcement in Southern California. But the danger does not appear to be over. Let's take a look at this live shot here. This might have been a crime scene on Thursday, but on Saturday it will once again host kids playing football. We're not going to run. We're not going to hide. While we're on that subject, we want to talk about the state of the state. That's today. We're going to have coverage uh, later on this morning for you. Keep it here. That's around mm -hmm. 1130 or so. Uh, but also, you always want to pay attention to the weather. You're always keeping track of that, especially <laughs> in the morning, because a lot yeah, of changes lately. Yeah. After talking to the mayor, we came here to City Hall to find out if the city manager also thinks the city of Sarasota could one day become bankrupt like the city of Detroit. The organizer of the festival was talking about Lego Man, of course, the link mm -hmm. made to that. Pretty much a cat out of the bag in terms of where he might have come from. The Sarasota Police Department already uses crime mapping to try to see where different crimes occur within the city but the police chief says this crime analyst will look much deeper than that. A lot of people are going to think there's a wrong way driver problem in those 15 miles. Down in Gainesville that crash you know not just fog but then mm -hmm. also brush fire and that brings us to something you're watching here. And some of what I'm seeing right now is it really is neck and neck when uh, you start looking at maps uh, for Florida for example and actually we have some video of Florida still some uh, voters out at the polls I believe uh, if we look at the video it is from Miami.